welcome back to this week's episode of Tide TV. I'm Sydney Matalora, the ASB Director of Academics and Athletics. And I'm Naomi, and I'm the ASB Club Manager. Here's everything we have for you for this week. DIA's battery donation drive and fundraiser ended last Friday, so thank you to everybody that donated their batteries, and the winning third period class will receive a pizza party. The TPSF Middle School Boys and Girls Basketball Tournament was last Wednesday. Congrats to the 6th grade boys for taking home first place and to the 7th grade boys for taking home third. Congrats to the 8th grade girls for taking home first place and to the 6th and 7th grade girls for taking home fifth. Great job to all of our middle school teams. Today marks the start of Women's History Month and March is the month where we honor all the women who have changed our society like Kamala Harris, Maya Angelou, and many more. NHS kicked off their fun animal shelter fundraiser on Monday and it will be continuing till Friday. Make sure to donate new dog toys, blankets, and food to your third period class and the winning class will receive boba popsicles. Tide pool tutoring is every Tuesday in the downstairs high school commons, so make sure to come and get help on any assignments or if you have to ask any questions. The next Rise pop-up shop is this Friday, so make sure to use your Rise raffle tickets to purchase exclusive items. We also have snacks and legacy merch available. Winter Athlete Basketball Tournament Lunchtime Activity has been rescheduled to this Thursday and Friday, so make sure to come out and support your high school athletes. Welcome back to the segment you've been waiting for, Legacy Sports Center. Spring sports have started and here are our first two games of the week. First, we have Tustin High School Boys Volleyball game featuring varsity 11th grader Ben No. This game will be at Northwood High School at 5.15 p.m. Next, we have a Beckman High School Frosh Volleyball game featuring 10th grader Jaden Sott. They're playing at Beckman High School against San Clemente at 3.30 p.m. As you've probably heard, our high school athlete three-on-three -three basketball tournament has been delayed and will be played tomorrow, March 2nd, and Friday, March 3rd. Congratulations to our middle school basketball teams for participating in their tournament at Orchard Hills this past week. Our sixth grade team placed first, our seventh grade placed third, and our eighth grade team also tied for third. We also have breaking news that eighth grader Micah Rin has sprained his left middle finger in his last basketball game playing in those in those games. If you know him, please wish him well. That's all we have for this week. Tune in next week for more highlights on the basketball tournament and incoming sports news. Next Thursday's Tide Shack special will be Lucky Charm Bar, so make sure you guys bring your ASB card to pick up your free treat. My name is Marissa Sanchez and I'm the president of High School Mock Trial here at Legacy. So please tell us about your club. Uh, so my club is Mock Trial. It's for high school, as I said before. So it's kind of like a fake trial where we have um, we have a case and we start sol try to solve the trial. We have attorneys and we have witnesses and we go through the whole process of like what goes on in the trial, you know, like objections, um, opening statements bunch of different stuff like that just to make it like uh, like a real trial but we just do a fake little version here at school. So why did you choose to start this club? Um, I chose to start this club because this is something I did back in middle school and I really enjoyed. I did it both in seventh and eighth grade and I had um, teacher leaders there which helped me and they uh, kind of inspired me to start it here and it's something that I, I enjoyed and I wanted to bring it here. Uh, there's no requirements to join our club. It's just if you're interested in anything, if you're interested in being an attorney or a lawyer, or if you really like to argue, then I'd recommend you come and you could come argue. It's really fun and it seems like it's not interesting, but when you get into it and when you get into ca the case, you get really passionate about it and it can be really fun. What are you guys doing today? So today I was going over objections, specifically the different types of objections we have in court. So that's uh, kind of when you, it helps strengthen your argument if you object the opposing side, and we were talking about it, what not to say, what to say, the best way to strengthen your argument. On March 13th through 17th, we're going to be having a multicultural week with the Multicultural Fair being on March 15th after school. And throughout this week, we'll be having many cultural foods and goods and cultural dances. And we'll also be having a fun spirit week, so make sure you guys stay tuned. That's it for this week's episode. Time to wave goodbye. Catch, Catch you on the next time. time.